Concentrate and <sighs> I think he used another lightning bolt. Okay, here it goes. <sighs> I did it again. Seems like you can keep making two like lightning bolts. I would join you in magic training, but if I remember, magical stabs can be quite dangerous. I'll train deeper in the woods later. Is it really that dangerous compared to my orb? Magical staves are different from magical orbs. A magical staff is much stronger than an orb, and much more impactful on the world around it. While you can make only one light when you can only make one lightning bolt per usage, I can make a lightning storm. That is why people that hope to become mages name the orb a beginner's catalyst. My staff doesn't manipulate magic but it can easily defeat your orb and magical abilities. Oh. Well, I'll go ahead deeper into the woods to do my own magic training. Bye. Well, so the skeleton left. But it, well, I should go check on the agency. But is the staff really that much stronger? Like he said, it would, like it can make a thunderstorm, but... Here I was thinking that I was like doing pretty good, but making a second bolt flame because I am pretty bad at magic. Oh, there's monsters here. Um, hello. Hi. So you help monsters, right? I have a quest for you. I left a picture that's important to me on a tree. Since you're an Enderman, retrieving it won't be much of a problem. Can you help bring it back to me? Of course. All right. The picture is on top of a large tree near a large house. The house is also close to a spider nest. The picture is also in a crate that I have been carrying around with me. I happened to venture out from the tree while leaving them behind. I saw a sign about the monster agency and decided to test it out. Thank you in advance. Okay, so he wants me to look. Basically, it's but well, it's near the large house, but that large house is near the. Spider nest, I know what he's talking about, because that's what has where the zombie came from. And it's a large tree near that house. It's in a crate on top of a tree. Okay. Oh, so they finished. Uh, it's not got what he wanted because this doesn't seem too big to like the zombies' house or anything like that. If only all the other houses were like that, that would be great. But anyway, oh, I forgot to tell the skeleton about the the flowers I saw and how they might have had, or well, they look like they had a or at least like maybe pink or magenta dye. But I did, oh my gosh, it's raining. <sighs> okay, this got a lot harder. I probably shouldn't have been strolling around. Because that means I'm gonna have to see if I can get through here without getting hurt too much. Okay. Run. Gotta run through here. <sighs> Don't get hurt. Okay. I'm alright. And it's thundering. Great. Hopefully I'm going in the direction of the house. <sighs> to keep planning my next decision. Oh, I think this is a spider place, so I might want to head over to the left. Oh no, I'm out in the open. Gotta get to that birch tree. Okay. Where it oh, there it is. Whew. But how am I gonna get there? With all this rain? Okay, I've gotta run. Ow, ow, this hurts. Oh no, gotta go down, 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 down. It hurts so much. Okay, gotta go down here. Phew. 
to calm down for a bit. And gotta go up there. Oh, so if I just teleport there, I did it. Whew. Now I just gotta teleport up to the top. Very careful with this. Careful and throw. I can't throw the. Maybe there's another way up. If I just get rid of some of these leaves. Oh, gotta make sure I hit him. Just gotta destroy these leaves. Oh no. Ow, ow. I shouldn't have done that. I need to get to the top of this. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, gotta hurry. If I don't hurry, it's gonna be bad. Okay, I'm gonna have to take the whole crate. I'm gonna need to get up there. Okay, I'm gonna need... <sighs> to breathe. Goodness gracious. Water is painful. Like lava or something. Just fire anything. It's just excruciating pain. Okay, got it. Go on through this. Okay. Whew. All right. Now, I think the spider want the crate too. So I'm gonna take this and then get the teleport. Oh no. Gotta be very careful of this. Okay. Teleport. Okay. Phew. Exploring is a dangerous job, kind of man, apparently. All I'm doing is helping other monsters out and get. I deal with rain problems. I can't even be out in the rain. And then it's constantly raining here. Uh, at least it feels like it. Okay, head through here. Whew. Now I'm at the places where there's a lot of coverage, so I'm okay. That's one thing we gotta make sure we keep at the village. I mean, not village. No, no, no. Okay. Luckily, no one else heard me say that. At the place where I am. Luckily, we don't have any. Uh, well, we, we have trees there, so we still have coverage. Which is probably a necess necessity for even the other mobs, like the zombies. Because of the fact that, you know, they can't be out in daylight. You know, I can't be out in rain. Okay! Weren't expecting rain, not unless I. But here is your stuff. Have you found it? Yes, I have. Thank you. So you really are different. Okay, now for the next one. Hello, Enderman. I have another quest for you. I dropped a ring that is important to me in the river while crossing the bridge near here. It is day, so I can't get it. I know you're an Enderman, but could you please help me get it before it gets lost? It's a gift from someone very special to me. Sure, I'll see if I can find a way to get it. Thank you! I know it would be difficult to reach without hurting yourself, so I spent this time wondering how far it could have gone. It probably is somewhere in the water across from the zombie that lives here's house. Okay, that helps a lot. Cause it's raining outside. Hi. No, sand, rain. Oh my gosh, run, 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 run. Let's see where the zombie's house is. Okay, gotta at least be under a tree. Cause this hurts. Ow, ow. Okay, I run to this tree. Now, it says in the river, so cross that one right there with the giant lake in it. Okay, 
Well, the giant lake, that is. Leads from a river. So we'll run to here. Okay, so right across from here. Just gotta keep following this direction. Because he lost his ring, and it's important to him, so I have to make sure I find it. And... Wait a second. Wait a second. It isn't... It's raining! Maybe he doesn't know or something. He'll figure it out. Oh, it is a quest is a quest. Oh, I wish I could <laughs> like not say that right now. A quest is a quest. What do you mean? I'm walking outside in the rain. And hurting myself. Trying to help him out. Oh dear. Ow, ow, my gosh. Okay, no, 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 no. Get out of here. This hurts so much. You know, it would be great if it would just stop raining for once, you know. Like, it's been raining all day. Okay. How to get ready to cross this place. Okay, this tree is too small. Okay, I should not... Ah, this tree is too small. Okay, now I am fine. So what I should do, actually... Let's make a ceiling here. Using the blocks I have. Just out to the water. Okay, this is two times as slow, because not only do I have to go make a path, I also have to make one above me, so I don't, like, get hurt from the rain. Hopefully I have enough dirt to go do this whole thing. Oh my gosh, how far have I Okay, I've gone pretty far. Okay. You know what? It's night now. I think... Oh, this will be the first quest that I haven't done. But the truth is, he can go out right now. So I can go and tell him and not go through the process and pain of all this. Because, well... It's rainy, for one. And then also, it's night, for two. So... He should be able to get this himself. Well, I do feel bad that I haven't had to do this quest, but... Okay! Please tell me you found it. Okay. So, I... I haven't found it, but it's raining right now, so I can't really... It's, t it's very difficult for me to go in water while it's raining and stuff like that. So I've been making a path, but it's taken me quite a while. Uh, how about, you know, it'll, it's night as well, so you can go out there and go find the ring, okay? <sighs> Man, that really was the first quest that I have never, well, I haven't been able to do. That's frustrating. There's gotta be some way that I can easily go about. Maybe if I, you know, just made a giant, like, roofing over, like, this giant this entire forest. Yeah, that wouldn't work. <sighs> I did see Kalo, and I think he was talking to someone. So I think I'll say hi, and just to make sure to check on him. Okay. Run, run, run. This house is slightly difficult to get to. Because I don't think there's many trees around there. Or at least they're in the back, but not in the front of it. Wait. It stopped raining. <gasps> I'm so happy. Yes, it stopped raining. But I didn't do the quest anyway. Hello. 
Callow. Nevertheless, I respect your decision. Oh, hey, Enderman. How are you feeling, Callow? Great! I have wholeheartedly enjoyed my stay here. I was just asking the slime here about his house. He realized that we are similar in the way that we are both here to watch how this place goes to some aspect. Yes, but we are quite different. Anyway, my house has been built. The bookcase golem did do a good job with making it look how I wanted to. Not too big to draw attention, but not cramped either. Anyway, I would like to learn more about any thoughts you may have had towards Rebrundo Callow. Why leave a kingdom where you are safe? Well, that's because, yeah, they're they're just going to continue with the conversation. They've been kind of talking this whole day, so yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and get ready for some magic practice. Okay. Might want to tell him about the lavender thing, too. Or, I mean, not lavender, but the flowers we saw. Well, anyway. I'm here to do some magic training. 